Hi, this is Tom Odie, and what we're watching here is the only two minutes and 30 seconds of footage available on Dallas from the Modi family Super 8 archives. This would be uh, mid-70s when we moved into the big house, and that's me and Abby in the backyard playing their football. And Dallas having the time of his life. Shot annoyingly through a screen door in the back, as you can see. Over to the right, you'll notice the famous iron spiked fence. This is the fence he would jump on occasion to have to get into the other yard and also once in a while get stuck on, as he did a couple times comically in the book. Dallas was young there, a couple years old, pesky dog as Abby takes a swipe at him. Another interesting thing about Dallas is he was a church-going dog. We only lived a couple houses away from the Catholic Church, and this is uh, my sister Lisa's baptism. And uh, he accompanied us. Oh, there he is up in the corner looking for a car to pounce on. My father carrying uh, what we call baby in the book. And Dallas didn't appear on video for another four years until my sister Nat, or Natalie, uh, was baptized. And this is her baptism. I'm there in the blue jacket. And Dallas is going to be left to wait. Christmas morning as he followed us down the stairs every year. And here is Gaines Park. Uh, a number of events in the book took place there. Uh, the butternut wars and a lot of dog fights and the art show. And here Dallas is running into the middle of a football game very similar to one that would have happened when he tackled Big Lou infamously. Uh, this is not that particular day though. Uh, this is shot from the bay window so this would be Dallas's view into the park that he would have every day to see what's kind of going on in the village. And this would have been uh, around 1978. Oh, he's going to take a whiz here, looking from the bay window again. And there's Nat and my grandfather. Uh, baby, we, uh, Lisa, and uh, that's me. Christmas morning, and there he is hanging out on the uh, deep green shag carpet. It was nice and soft for him. You can see his gray muff there. And, and there he is, uh, you know, infamously in that window, the big bay window, looking out, seeing what's going on in the village. Uh, great time for Sherburne in the uh, late 70s.